Oh, welcome back to Lesser Pros Minecraft Adventure. Although, to be honest, for like <laughs> uh, last episode, this episode, and, a, and f probably a few more future episodes, it's pretty much Smeagolo's Minecraft Adventure. But uh, <laughs> anyway, this is episode 20, actually, is it? Huh. I think so. Wow, 20 already. Actually, I just turned 20. That's hilarious. Okay. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm here finishing off this map. If you remember from last episode, uh, I started this map last episode, I think. No, wait, no, wait I, uh, yeah, I, like, made the outline of it last episode. But now we're going to finish it, like, right now. It's t taken forever, like all these maps do. But anyway, the plan for this episode is to, well, to finish this map, and then, uh, I don't know, look at, look at the map compared to the other two maps, and, you know, just look at them. And then afterwards, I think I'll uh, start up the southeastern map. Like, I'll set it up on video, or like I'll cut to when when I set it up or whatever, and I'll show how I do that. But, um, yeah, that's the goal for this episode. And I got so much to talk about, though. I mean, like, I just announced uh, Storm the Castles 2 on my uh, forum thread, and just all over the forums, really. So, um, yeah, that's an exciting project I've started. I want to talk a lot about that, <laughs> and, uh, oh yeah, a new, uh, I, I've decided to try to make some, oh, finish the map, yay! <laughs> I've decided to, uh, try to make CTM map LP highlight videos, um, I'm not sure if I should do, like, per map, but for, like, all of my, uh, CTM map LPs, or all of our CTM map LPs, because Chuckles has played on a on like a couple of them, actually. Um, I wanted to make like a highlight video of all the best moments out of either one map or all the maps combined. Um, I'm I'm pretty sure I should I'll, I'll do it like per map because there's a lot of highlights in every map, and to put all of the highlights of all the maps in one video is gonna be pretty ridiculous. <laughs> so yeah, I'm probably just gonna settle for uh, doing one per map. Well, that's not settling for it. It's kind of making more, but yeah, it's going to be awesome. I kind of want to give CTM like more attention because it's kind of like, a, I think it's a better form of like adventure maps. It gives you more freedom, even though adventure maps can get fancy because they don't let you break blocks, so you, you can uh, do different things with that. But I think that takes away from the experience, to be honest, but whatever. But uh, yeah, I want... CTMs to get more attention, so I'm gonna make a highlight videos, which should hopefully, if I make them k good enough, get uh, tons of views and get people into CTM. So um, that's my goal for that. Uh, it's probably not gonna be for a while because I have to watch through like every episode of like an LP to find highlights, <laughs> write them down, and then uh, download my video. I think I'm pretty sure YouTube like lets you download your own videos back to your hard drive. I'm really hoping so. I'm pretty sure you can, but yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm gonna be doing. Probably while I'm building Storm the Castles too, I'll just like have my LP playing in the background or something. Not just for free views, man. I'm trying to produce highlight videos. I'm not just doing it for the few free views. Shut up. Anyway, <laughs> so yeah, that's gonna be awesome when I finish those. And I have some ideas for highlights already of like Pantheon. Uh, if you rem remember the belly of the beast, um, <laughs> so I've been watching a lot of South Park recently as well, and I just saw the episode of the, the first episode that Lemmy Winks was in, and that song, along with the belly, belly of the beast area, <laughs> is gonna be the most hilarious thing ever. So I'm really excited to make that. <laughs> just imagine, like I'll have like these random clips of me wandering around in the belly of the beast while that song is playing in the background. Oh, it's gonna be hilarious. Okay. Um, so yeah, that's exciting. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Highlight videos. Awesome. All right. So enough about highlights. Um, I was also thinking, uh, yeah, I want to talk about Storm the Castles 2 a lot this episode, probably. Ugh, it's gonna be hard to ma maintain focus on what I'm doing on this map, but, uh, <laughs> Anyway, so yeah, Storm of the Castles 2 is a thing. Um, I started it, like, two days ago. I've made the starting area. I think it looks gorgeous. I haven't quite finished it yet. I still have to build the Victory Monument, which is going to be, uh, like, uh, on the lower roof portion. 
I'll build that uh, sometime soon. And also I have a few other things like shops to make or to build at least. I'm probably going to wait a bit to um, pr actually put in the villagers because, yeah, I want to I want to do it right this time in terms of CTM map building, unlike Storm of the Castles 1, which is... Eh. So m the main problem with Storm of the Castles 1, I think, was of course the aesthetics. And biggest reason for that... Um, very large discrepancy of aesthetic production value versus gameplay production value. The, the, the big determining factor that made that so bad was that I tried to implement gameplay mechanics while building the aesthetics, and that's not something you should do when building CTM. You should start out, build the aesthetics, and then implement spawners and gameplay mechanics after you implement the aesthetics. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to do that this time, so don't screw it up major, majorly. And on top of that, I've got tons of building experience out of the first map. And, well, well, starting to work on Blitz, I got a bit of map making experience, I guess. But, um, yeah, so now I've stepped up my production value in map making. Actually taking my time to make things look good. <laughs> and uh, I think it's going to turn out awesome if I do it right. But, uh, of course, it's in the very, very, very early stages of, of development. And won't be ready to release until, like, next year or something. Yeah. So yeah, that's Storm of the Castles 2. I'm really tempted to show like uh, just like a fly through of the of what I've built so far, but yeah, should save that for later. <laughs> anyway, and I, I'm not done with the Victory Monument monument as well, which I want to be done with if I want to do a fly through. But anyway, let's put let's see uh, the map updated on the wall. Yes, it did update. When I mapped this, it uh, updated this map on the wall over here because it's the same map. And uh, let's just see it next to the other two. I guess while those are loading in, I can uh, stick this map in here. I don't really need it anymore. I think, yeah, this is this map is that map. <laughs> this map is that map. And now this map is that map. Okay. So now i got to make another map. So I can start the uh, southeastern one. Uh, I need like eight pieces of paper. One piece of redstone. So organized. Huh? And four pieces, I mean four iron ingots. And one, two, three, four. Four. Okay. And just toss these in the crafting table. I forgot to start the timer. Oh, god dang it. <laughs> Such a derp when I craft. Okay. Compass in the middle. Map. And I'm not going to open it yet. I'm going to wait till I'm in the right position. Right about here to uh, open the map so uh yeah i think i'll pause it right here and uh come back when i'm back on this well actually i'll come back when i'm almost there so uh yeah be right back okay so here we are at the nether portal in the middle of the map i just made and we're at 2680 63 1898 so you add 2048 to the Z value, and it'll give you the south value that uh, I'll be going for, which is 3946. I totally did that in my head. <laughs> so anyway, let's uh, go south, 2048 blocks. Yay, it's going to take forever. Uh, something I forgot to mention in the last episode, I got a new mouse and new keyboard, which are hopefully quieter than my last ones. They're both wireless now, and those keyboards actually a a solar powered keyboard so it's kind of interesting um, so far it's maintained full power even though I play mostly at night it's kind of funny but um, yeah I think it's pretty cool um, Logitech on both though actually a funny story the mouse so I got a new mouse and the new one the scroll wheel didn't have clicks or like notches so when you scroll it wouldn't you know you wouldn't know how, how many you scrolled because there's no notches. And I need those notches for, like, well, Call of Duty 4 and, of course, Minecraft. Uh, Call of Duty 4, I use it for quick switching with weapons, but nobody cares about that. But, um, yeah, for my Minecraft, like, without notches, it's really hard to tell how many <laughs> inventory slots you've scrolled down. And I need that desperately because I, I scroll instead of I use my number keys. Some people use number keys. I just don't. can't stand them. But, um... <laughs> Yeah, I, I needed notches, so uh, I just gave the mouse to my dad, and it turns out dad had a pretty 
nice mouse. Eh, that you know, there's a spare mouse, and it's actually pretty nice. So yeah, that's what I'm using right now. Uh, the the new mouse I had gotten was actually a quieter clicker, but the scroll wheel just you know <laughs> is big no no. So yeah, I'd sacrifice a bit louder. I mean a bit a bit of a, yeah whatever. <laughs> So yeah, this is my new mouse and keyboard, and hopefully they're not as loud as the, as the previous ones on video. I've noticed with this microphone, it really likes to pick up those uh, mouse and keyboard noises. Um, so um, yeah, hopefully that's better. Anyway, I'm gonna pause it right here and come back when I'm nearing the uh, coordinate, the goal coordinates, I'll call them. Well, this sucks. <laughs> uh, this is just about where I'm supposed to make the center of the map, and it's in the middle of the ocean. Okay. Uh, whatever. Just head back a few more blocks. Uh, get off to my boat. Don't break it so I can actually get out of here. Uh, 20, 39, 46, 26, 80, I believe. 39, 46, 26, 80. All right, all I have to do right here is start the map. And then I can, you know, build the base wherever. So here it goes. Just make sure I make jacked coordinates, even though it doesn't really matter that much. Okay. Looks about right. So I've started the map. Now I can just head towards that land and build the build another portal there, and then you know build the map up from here. And wow, that boat ran away from me, and I didn't even touch it. Come on now, <laughs> get back here, boat. You're so glitchy. Boats are always so glitchy. Yeah, here. All right. And it's nighttime too, so now there's gonna be mobs and everything. Ugh. Oh, you're gonna break prematurely, boat? Nope. You're just gonna send me back. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, cure the spider. And I guess I'll build another portal like right here. Why not? Yeah. A bit laggy. Let's turn that off. Let's so turn that off. Did it try to save a screeny? <laughs> I think I might have accidentally pressed F4. I'm not sure if that's a screeny button or not. Ah, I forget. Alright. Uh, seems about right. Let's just uh, make a little cobblestone hut. Do do do. It's got to be even because n nether portals are even. Ah, why do I even care? Okay. <laughs> Map making mode. Activate! Hey, wait. Gonna have to do this. Yeah, it's cool. Get a little block variation in there. <laughs> Speaking of block variation. Uh, yeah, it's another goal of Storm the Castles 2 is to actually have block variation in the walls. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of part of the aesthetic thing. I guess. Can't just leave walls blank stone. Gotta put some uh, noise and junk in it. Alright, let's build this nether portal. And uh, build up the map as well. Is it odd, really? <laughs> well, I guess, meh. <laughs> I guess I was planning to do this. Uh, to cover up the, the wood on the tree. Yeah, whatever. Alright. Nether portal time. Do, 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 do. No, wait. Actually, I do this, yeah. <laughs> that was totally intentional. Okay. Then we light her up. Alright, right, please don't bug out and, like, bring me to a different... to another portal that I've already been through. Oh, that'd be stupid. If remember our nether portal fail at spawn. Or our spawn nether portal thingy. But uh, just in case, I'm gonna you know, finish the, the base here and not and not wait until after I've come back out of it or out of the nether because it's sketchy to go into the nether without finishing your base. Okay, just need to make, it, make a door for the... oops, drop my diamond axe. <laughs> okay, uh, let's make a couple chests. Or just one chest, not, not a couple of what I'm doing. Uh, Plop it down like that, and now I can uh, make the map, or build the map up. Doo -doo -doo. Hopefully it doesn't bug out on me. That would suck. Alright. Tier 2 map. Squid just died for some reason. <laughs> Must have, like, popped out of the water and suffocated. <laughs> Interesting. Poor squid. Alright. Let's uh, size it up again. Okay. Good, it's working, not bugging out like it like it uh, used to in like the first few episodes. Ooh, interesting islands though. Looks like actual islands. Alright. Just two more upgrades, I think. 
or uh, map up sizes. And we're getting there. Okay, one more. Wait, no, I must think there's two more actually. Um, is it? No, I think that's it. Yeah, it's four out of four. One to sixteen. Alright. So this map is going to take forever to complete, but I'm not going to do that on video because I would be lame. Whoa! <laughs> oh, you surprised me. Okay. Let's build a door for this thing. Uh, okay. It's going to give me three doors. don't need three doors. I only need two doors. Ugh. Put the other door in the chest. Spider eye me. Alright. Let's risk all this stuff on my inventory and go through the nether, nether portal. I have a potion of fires this. I shouldn't die. So, here it goes. Don't take me to it. <laughs> Another portal we've already been through. That would be lame. Come on. Oh, yeah. Server's been running slow. And, yay, it's a new nether portal. I don't recognize this terrain. Okay. Guest, let's uh, protect this nether portal. Now that we've made it in a good location, holy mother of... Okay. You gonna shoot at me, Gast? Too far away? Okay. <laughs> Alrighty then. Let's block this off. Okay. And then block off the nether portal from nasty guests. Actually, that door would come in handy. <laughs> Should have kept it. Yeah, whatever. I'll make two new doors to put in so it's symmetrical. Do, do, do. And then after I make this space, I'll have to go through the nether and find one of my other ne nether portals. Or, yeah, to link it up. So, it's probably going to be on video. Hopefully I have time. I got a few minutes left. I knew you were going to shoot at me eventually. Oh, God. <laughs> Should have deflected that. thought I deflected that first one, but I guess not. Whatever. Didn't do any harm. Well, didn't do too much harm. <laughs> Bloody gas, get out of here. Let's block this off completely so I don't derp up. Uh, actually, it's unnecessary, but actually it is necessary because i got to block off the portal. Okay, hey, there we go. Okay, let's just make this symmetrical. Some OCD like that. Nope, another gas, really. Get out of here, you're really loud on videos, guests. Always. So, let's see. Do, 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 do. Okay. Actually, that's not very... Ugh. <laughs> hate myself. Okay. Uh, crafting table and chests. So one, one, two. Well, actually, no. Not chests. Uh, uh, crafting table and door. Ugh. Kind of derped this up. That's going to be a chest place, I think. But then I'm going to have to make another... Ah! I suck. Okay. Let's just put the map on the inventory. I don't need that there anymore. Okay. Chest. Doors. Done. Alright. So now I believe I should head north from here. So, like, eh, east, south, north. Alright. Let's head north until we find my, eh, eastern portal nether link. I have plenty of blocks on me, do I? No, I don't. Okay, so this is going to be... Uh, sketchy. Let me pick up a bunch of blocks here. Because, <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have to block over several uh, lava bits, I think. Uh, so that's not going to be fun. I should probably look around here for a bit, to be honest. Whoa. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Just to check if there's any net, uh, nether fortresses or something. Do do do. Anything over here? Anything? Another lag. Just soul sand, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's probably nothing. There's, there's a good nether fortress right by our first nether, nether portal, so I'm not too worried about that. Anyway, let's uh, cross here. Might as well. A lot of soul sand, though. Ow, fall damage. <laughs> Somehow. Feather falling four, I think I have, don't I? Ooh, I was on fire for a sec. He nipped me. All right. So this is north, right? Pretty sure. Yep, north. Okay. It should be a ooh, ne nether fortress. 
I don't think it's the one that we have though. So yeah, new new Nether Fortress. Yay! <laughs> I guess. Okay. Let's, uh, is that? No, that flame isn't where my other Nether Link is. We're not gonna find it for a while. Eh. Yeah. <laughs> Twenty. Yeah, 2,048 blocks even divided by 8 is still a long way to go. I hear a gas, and I really don't want to block over this with a gas hanging around, but eh, got a potion of fire resist, no biggie. Doo -doo -doo. It's going to be a sketchy run back and forth. <laughs> like, the new mouse might freak out, and then I'll take a dive or something. That would suck. Uh, do 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 All right. Getting near to the end of the episode. What was that? Oh, tch. it's not lightning flashing in real life. It is a... Uh, oh, there it is. Uh, it was like flashing, but it's just the lights freaking out in this room. Uh, they're adjustable lights so that you can make them a bit dull, uh, dimmer. And uh, yeah, they're on a pretty, uh, slightly dim setting, but I don't know, something with the circuitry makes it uh, jump around in dimness. That makes flashy, flashiness. Why am I describing this? <laughs> uh, okay, back to back on subject. I'm almost back to the Eastern Netherlink, and then to get back and forth from here, uh, uh, I mean to get from the main Nether Nether portal to the southeastern one. I'll first run to the eastern one, and then run south from here or from there. I'll probably work on the path to make it a bit better, uh, off video or whatever, but. For now, it's uh, it's another link, and I can fin it, and I can do this map at my own discretion, or whatever you want to call it, or whatever you want to say about it. All right, where is it? Yeah, there we are. That's a yeah. <laughs> so that's the path, and I don't go, I don't go through that another portal. It just takes me to the center of the eastern map. What I want to do is go to the back to base by going back here. So anyway, I think I'll just pause it here, come back at base for, the, you know, like, wrapping up with the episode, probably. Alright, made a copy of the map, so now I'm, uh, making an item frame to stick up on the wall next to the other three so that I can get updated on the wall while I'm eh, filling it out. So, that's the crafting re recipe for an item frame, by the way, in case you were wondering. <laughs> I didn't know that for, lo for the longest time, I had to look it up for like this series actually. All right, now I have a copy of that on me. <laughs> so yeah, not much to look at so far, but uh, eventually it'll be awesome next to the other three. Doo -doo -doo. I'm wondering like, uh, hmm. I'm thinking that eventually, no, that would suck because that's like an ocean in the middle there. I, I was thinking we would make our, make our main base here and then, you know, have us centered around this kind of map just to have like all the biomes because the desert's gonna be way over here but maybe I'm thinking like yeah maybe like in the middle here yeah that would probably look the coolest I mean there's some pretty cool mountains in there and it's not in the middle of the ocean and it gets uh, the ice biome down there in that corner or desert biome down there in that corner and who knows what's gonna get up here in these corners so yeah that would be pretty awesome to put like a base or a big castle somewhere in there eh yeah, shut up. Anyway, like, uh, I guess post any questions about Storm of the Castles 2 or highlight videos or anything in the comments. And, uh, yeah, yeah can't wait to do all these summer projects. They're going to be awesome. <laughs> I need a job, though. Oh, boy. Summer job or summer projects? How about both? Why not both? Because, uh, ugh. Anyway, see you next time.